don't have that information because I'm lying. Good morning, guys. It is Friday, and today is the day me and my dad are traveling to Atlanta alone. I have all my stuff packed. I am just charging this portable charger, and I'm trying to make sure that I don't forget it because I most likely will forget it. I have everything else ready, and we're gonna get Starbucks for breakfast, which I'm really excited for, because I haven't had Starbucks in a while. But I have a Starbucks gift card, so let me grab that. Oh, and guys, something really exciting happened last night. I got the gift card. Anyways, back to what was exciting last night. So I was just on FaceTime with Alexis, and I was just looking at Sephora, because um, I really wanna get the Pink Sugar Summer Friday, and I've been wanting to get it for forever. And it's always sold out. So I just check online, but the pink sugar sold out. But guess what's in stock? Their new birthday cake. Like they literally just released it, I think, because like I'm surprised it wasn't sold out. And also last time I checked for them to be in stock, like it wasn't even out yet, but I ordered them and I'm so excited. They're coming like next week. And I'm actually so surprised that I even got it because I thought they'd be sold out like right away, but they weren't and I ordered some and I used my Sephora gift cards for that. Okay guys, I was filming with another memory card, didn't work, so I have to repeat everything. Alison has to weigh in at six o'clock. Right now she's gonna go to the gym because she has to lose the water. I think I'm gonna be here right now. Huh? I think I'm gonna be here right now. Where? At Target. Why? Because I don't have time this weekend, so I'm filming now. Oh, wow. Well, don't mind my outfit, but I was preparing Rafael Maleta. Emily's gonna take this black camera. Alison and me, we're gonna stay with the white one. Tomorrow, Alison have the steak competition. I'm going tomorrow. Today, I'm gonna spend the day with my dad. If you suggested the blow, you know that he had surgery. They removed his shoulder, so it's a big surgery. Huh? They've completely removed his shoulder. Yeah. They put everything inside the shoulder. Yesterday, I spent the whole day at the hospital, but he went back home. My sister was with him at home for two or three hours. Today, I'm gonna spend the day with him. I would like to go to public to buy some healthy snack, like Greek yogurt, fruit, because he's taking a lot of painkiller. You know, they are very strong medicines, so he need to have food all the time in his stomach. Rafael made a soup yesterday too for him, so I'm gonna bring it today. They have everything ready, and for the first time, Emily is traveling with Raphael alone for four days. Today is Friday. Do you think I have to call the school for you? Yeah. Oh. This isn't a school thing. Okay. Well, if you say I'm sick, a couple of my teachers already know that I, I told them. I was like, I'm not going to be here tomorrow, but you can still... Look, she put the plane... Because she's traveling. Oh, but I don't know the blurry. The plane. What time are we leaving? What time? Yeah. Yeah. Do you want to order that? Okay. So they are leaving. I'm going to stay with Coco and Chanel tonight here. But like I said, I'm going to be during the day with my dad. And at night, I'm going to be with these two babies that they are stressed because they think I'm leaving too. Okay. She's leaving. They're going to go. Hi. Buenos dias. They are living in Rafael truck, so I don't know how they're gonna do it because Rafael truck has a lot of stuff inside. Ella se puede sentar? Oh, they clean it for you. Look that. That's the construction truck. Emily, después te sacude el pantalón que va a estar. Que dame un beso. Cuida, papá, oíste? Did you put the camera in the back? Say bye, love you. Okay. Guys, we just made it to the airport and we're gonna put the stickers on our suitcases. And we just found out that our flight's delayed for an hour, so that's fun. It was supposed to be at 11, now it's at 12, but we're still gonna get to Atlanta around like two o'clock, which is good because my practice isn't until five. So let's hope it doesn't get delayed anymore. But we're gonna check our bags in and then head to our gate. Guys, we've been sitting here for a little bit, and my dad went and got some Chick fil A because we're hungry. So far, so good, guys. Hello, guys. So, I just got back. I went to Target and filmed a self care shopping video. So, I'll show you guys what I got. I got Mighty Patches for my pimples. I got this Biotin Plus Carotene vitamin pill thing. So, I'm gonna probably get one of these and put like my Accutane and my pills 
all in there so I can start taking them every single day. And then I also got these Mila drops for making my hair grow, which this also helps with hair, skin, and nails. So I'm hoping that actually does help. Gum, of course. We got Liquid IV, which I need to pack for today. Um, I leave for States in a little bit. Currently like almost 11. I leave at 12. Yes, I got the flavor Aussie Berry. I usually get like strawberry or something, but I think it'll be really good. And then I got Dragon Fruit Tree Hut because it smells so good and it looks so pretty. And then lastly, I got this SPF Face Mist from Sunbum. So you just go like, and that's it, which I feel like is so easy. Right now, I'm going to start getting ready and start packing all of my stuff up, like my skincare, my makeup, like everything. So there's a lot, a lot to do. Tonight we're going to Carrabba's and I'm really excited for like a grilled chicken, Caesar salad, and bread. But I pretty much can't eat till six. I can have gum. So I'm probably gonna have to bring a pack of gum with me. Um, I need to pack my water bottle. Let's start packing everything I need. Oops. So let's make like a pile. Cause I had like a pile in my room already, like clothes and stuff. But I need to first find a backpack. Cause I don't, I think Emily took the bag I used last time. So. But these are me and Emily's registrations forms for next year. So I have to bring these in so that we can actually get classes next year. We have gum, liquid IV. Got my water bottle. We'll probably go to Publix and get stuff. So for now, honestly, I probably won't get anything or bring anything. Now let's go to my room and pack everything up. It's really, it's one night. So it's tonight and then we compete tomorrow and I drive home with my mom tomorrow. So it's not really like crazy. Um, I have my weightlifting bag over there that I obviously need to bring. That would be really, really bad if I forgot. Actually, my mom would be able to bring it to me. So it's gonna be like terrible, but like we're not gonna forget it. I already took my Accutane for today so that I don't have to bring any pills or anything. So let's put this stuff away. So I'll put this in here for now. This is like my bag for traveling. So I have my face wash and my lotion. I have this, I need to pack, this is Listerine my toothbrush and toothpaste. I swear I have a new toothbrush somewhere. Oh yeah, I have a pack down here. Do you think it's time? Okay, I don't think I need to get a new one yet, but I probably will soon. We have lip roller, razor, um, spray, like perfume, lotion, all of that is in there. I don't even know if I wanna wear makeup tomorrow. I don't really know. Um, I'll probably bring like a little bit just in case like I do end up wanting to wear. I have some hair ties in here also. Oh, I also have to check how much I weigh right now. Um, I haven't checked. I checked this morning, but then I went to the sauna and stuff and I spit. So like I need to check again how much I'm weighing because I don't know right now. Oh, I need to pack deodorant. This is like a must. So we're definitely gonna put that in there. I have my headphones charging right now. And this is the clothes I've picked out. Just a hoodie, shorts, Brawl and underwear so far. I need to get my singlet also. Do I bring a t-shirt? I'm gonna bring our district championship shirt. So I'll just sleep in that tonight. I'm gonna bring these sweatpants also because you have my comfy sweats. And then I need to bring my singlet. I'm gonna try it on right now because I haven't worn this one in a while, but it says LG on the back. So I'm gonna try it on and weigh in with this to see how much I'm weighing. Almost done. I just need to find like a backpack. And I'm also gonna bring my book because I don't really want to just use my phone all the way up, so I'm just going to bring my book with me so I can read. And I'm so hungry, but it's okay. It's okay. It's okay. I need to take off my jewelry. I need to take off my necklace. Okay, let's find a backpack for all this. Um, I swear, like, I had, like, a pile of backpacks right there, and now they're all gone. I think I'm only took them. Okay, I have that Lululemon one, but it's honestly kind of small. We have this Jansport one. It might be broken, though. Let's hope it's not, but we're gonna check. I feel like this might be Emily's broken one from this year and then she had to get another one. Yeah, she seems good. Okay guys, I have everything ready. I'm just waiting for Allison to be ready to drop her at her school. I'm bringing soup for my dad, some fruit. I'm gonna have here my protein shake, my water, and I'm going to stop at Publix to buy more food. She's ready, and the flight for Emily and Raphael is delayed. 
Right now it's 11.30 and they say they're gonna be boarding maybe around 12. The fly is leaving at 12.45. So hopefully Emily can make it with enough time to go to her practice tonight. Hey guys, we're boarding the plane. Okay, so I weighed myself with my singlet and no bra. I was 129.6, same weight as this morning. And then I weighed myself in this like sleep bra and underwear, no singlet, 128.8. How is a singlet almost an entire pound? I have no idea, but I don't know. So I'm just gonna spit the whole way up and hope that their scale is light and that I am fine. I need to grab all the stuff from the kitchen. I don't know what shirt I wanna wear. I don't really wanna wear a hoodie. I'm gonna figure everything out and then I have to leave soon, so. So I bought for my daddy this yogurt, banana, jelly, granola, and this prune because the pain medicine is gonna stop you to go to the bathroom. So it's very important that you eat prune stuff so you can go to the bathroom easily. And some alani for me. Guys, we made it to Atlanta. Right now we're getting our suitcases and then we're gonna go find our car. My phone was dead, literally like the whole flight, so I just slept the whole flight. And right now I'm sitting down just charging my phone while my dad gets the suitcases. Guys, we're currently waiting to get our car. And there is a huge line, like a huge line. I'm sitting here charging my phone because it's like still kind of dead. But it's literally like 3.30 and I have to go to practice by like 5.00. So we don't even know if we're gonna have time to go to the hotel. We might just have to go straight to the place because we don't have much time. Um, my dad just found out that apparently there's like people that have been waiting like hours for their car because this like place, they don't have cars for some reason. And my dad's still in line. We're gonna see if that's what happens to us. And if it does, we're gonna have to get an Uber to buy practice and my dad's gonna come back later to get the car. But let's just hope we don't have to wait two to three hours to get the car because we don't have time for that. Okay, we just found out something else that we're supposed to wait here until we get a text. And if you're not here when you get the text, they give your car to somebody else. And we don't have time for that, so we're getting an Uber. Guys, guys, update of my day. It's been a nice day until like an hour ago. I spent like four hours with my mom and my dad. He was fine, he doesn't have any pain. I prepared the yogurt with the fruit, how I like to do that recipe, he love it. And now I'm home, but Rafael called me. You know that Rafael is not good with the technology, okay? So last minute I rent a car, so it's gonna be easier for them to move to one place to other, so he called me. They cannot find the reservation, I cannot, the line is too long. People are here saying that they have been here for two or three hours waiting for the car. The flight got delayed already, so Emily won't make it to her practice. What I should do? I said, oh my God, Rafael. I'm in Florida, you are in Georgia, what do you want me to say? Figure it out, I don't know. The other thing is, Emily forgot her portable charger. Both of them have 5% of battery. Oh my God, that's why I say this lady has to be there involved with everything, guys. Moms, who moms, we can do like 20 things at one time. Sorry guys, but with one, you are like done. I don't know if you understand me, but we can do everything. They, don't, they only can do one thing. So I said, Rafael, I don't know what to do. I sent all the screenshots for the third time, not the first one, the third time, with all the car reservation information, the company. He didn't know the name of the company. He didn't know anything. Well, I sent that again. I said, mom, okay, I'm leaving home. Well, on my way here, while I was driving, I have to call the hotel for the third time because they didn't answer the phone, saying the reservation is under my name. I won't be there, but my husband, Rafael Gonzalez, is gonna be there doing the check-in. They hang up on me three times. I was so annoying. That was on my way home from my mom. I called for the third or fourth time. And I said to the guy, don't make me explain everything again. You and your friend have been hanging up. Please just help me. 
Uh, he said, okay, I can help you. They, the call was like, blah, 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 blah. I don't know why the call, it was so bad to, he couldn't hear me. I don't know what was wrong. Well, the point is he helped me, but while he was helping me, Raviel was calling me and I said, something is going on because he had been calling, calling, calling. And I was driving at the same time. Well, at one point, the, the guy from the hotel put me on hold and I answered Raphael. I said, what is wrong? No, I talked with the girl here. They say that they have been here for three hours and they don't give any car to them. If I wait that, Emily won't make it. Okay, Raphael. Okay, what are you going to do? He said, we're leaving. Cancel the reservation of the car. I said, okay. Well, I talked with the guy of the hotel. He was talking with me, you know, that I put him on hold. I said, please put Raphael on the reservation. He's gonna be there. Oh, okay. And they helped me with that. But that was a problem. The call, it was, it was not that easy. But at the end, they helped me. So they add him on the reservation. Then I start texting. I know I shouldn't drive and text, okay? Don't do what I do. I start, well, on the red line, okay? No, like driving. Expedia, because I booked the car on Expedia.com to cancel the reservation. At the end, she told me, it was back and forth. At the end, she said, no, you have to call the company because they have to cancel the reservation. It was only like $42 a day. It was like 150 and 60, something like that, the total. I lied because they told me, because they asked me why you cancel, why you won't pick up the car. I don't know what to say. What really happened is that Rafael doesn't want to wait because, make it, because Emily won't make it to practice, but I cannot say that. I said, because my flight got canceled and I won't be traveling anymore. That's a lie because I don't know what to say. And she said, well, you have to call the company of the car and you have to give the flight number, the cancellation number, which one is the next flight that they put you on. I don't have that information because I'm lying. It's a lie. So what I'm gonna do, I'm gonna lose the money. And I'm gonna lose the reservation. I don't know what to do. And now I have been calling Raphael and Emily because the last call that they did to me, I don't know if Emily's blogging guys, because I bet she's stressed. The last time that I talked with him, it was at 3.39. Right now it's 4.27. I called them seven minutes ago and they don't answer the phone. But at 3.38, Raphael said, I'm leaving to the hotel that is 30 minutes away from the airport in a bus. Why they're not leaving in an Uber? I don't know if he's lying to me. So let me try to call one more time, but they don't answer because they don't have battery. They don't have the portable charger. They don't answer. I don't know if they have battery. I don't know if they're leaving. I don't know what is wrong. They don't answer the phone. Let me call Emily. Oh, Emily's texting me what she said. We can talk right now. She said, we are probably just going straight to my practice because we won't have time to go to a hotel right now. Where are you? In Uber or a bus? Why you can talk? Let's see what she said because they cannot talk. Why? No idea. It's 428. Her practice is at 5. So they have to go straight to the place. Oh my God, I don't know if they ate already, if they have food. She doesn't answer. Let me open two packages while I wait for Emily to answer me. And also, like I said, it's 429 and Alison has to wait in at 6. So. Oh, this is something for Emily. I'm gonna leave this so she can open and show you that. And the other box that I have here is from Sasha Fitness. I just took my pills. You know that it's two in the morning and two at nine. Not at nine in the afternoon because that pill give you energy. She doesn't answer me. Why? Oh my goodness. I ordered another collagen. No? I have the strawberry, the caramel macchiato, and the on flavor but I never tried the chocolate one. And a lot of people are talking about the chocolate one, so I'm gonna be trying that. She doesn't answer. And the BCCA, the other one was gone and it was pineapple flavor. This time I bought the watermelon flavor and more fit nine. 
this one I have a lot, but you have to take like four daily, so I did the order. I said, okay, let me put this one because one chipping and that's it. I need to sneeze. I just ate white rice, sardine, and I'm drinking one Alani that I just bought today. And it was hot because it was in my car and I just put ice. And I'm leaving to the gym around 6.30. Tonight I'm gonna sleep by myself. We cook one channel here in in the house because Allison is an hour away, and you know Rafael and Emily. I don't know what they're doing. Why don't they answer me? I will keep you updated. But look, I asked a lot of things and she's not answering. So hopefully she's blogging so you can have more information than me because you are watching this in one blog and I'm living this in the moment. So I don't know what is happening. Okay. See you later. Let's go to the ding, ding, ding. Pa, 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 pa. I'm gonna see my period and my boot hurts. Peace. Okay, guys, we just went into an empty line and we rented a car. And we can choose Enterprise. Say it. Enterprise. Enterprise. They're That's so please. nice. And they say section two, pick any car. Excuse me, what? We can pick any car? Um, Let's see, which one do we want? This one seems nice. Hmm. Let's find a nice car, guys. We can pick any. Okay, guys, we're picking this Toyota. That's actually crazy, guys. Enterprise. You can choose any car you want. Like, that's crazy. And you just... Okay. Guys, we're pranking my mom. Well, at first, we were thinking of this when we were first getting the car, and then it almost actually happened. We're pranking her that we didn't get the car, which we didn't, and now we're in just, like, a random bus. This is my dad's idea, by the way. There's no internet right here. And we're going straight to the my practice because we have like no time and it's already like 30 minutes away. Okay guys, we figured out where we're parking and guys, the, the place, like it's already packed and I have to get my clothes and then we have to walk over there and I need to change and stuff because I have practice in like 30 minutes. But since we have so much time, we're gonna prank call my mom. She called us on the way here, but none of us answered because we were too busy trying to figure out what we're doing. And then also she texts me, cause I text her, I was like, we can't talk right now. Cause we were trying to figure out where to park and stuff. And she's like, why can't you talk? Are you in an Uber or a bus? Answer me, blah, blah, blah. I'm gonna call her. So we're calling her. And then she's gonna ask for you and, and I will say that you're, you're crying and you're upset. Okay. And, and, you, I, and she will say, let me talk to her. She's, you'll say, I want to talk, okay? Okay, we're pretending, I'm, I'm we're pretending that we're lost. Yeah, we're pretending I'm that almost, we're lost. I'm out of and that we're not even in Atlanta okay. anymore. We took a train and like a bus to a completely different place. Talk in Spanish, okay? In Spanish, so she doesn't know this. Hello? Dale. Yes, yeah. dime. Mija, es rápido, que no tengo ni batería. No, no, lo que tengo son 3%, creo 4. Cogimos una guagua y nos bajamos a un pueblo que no es ni Atlanta, ya, ¿viste? Ahora te la estamos corriendo para coger un tren. Emily está dando gritos, ya tú sabes cómo es esto, ¿no? ¿Y por qué no lo cogiste un Uber? ¿Qué Uber voy a coger? Si ahí no es donde nos dejó para rentacar, es como, como 10 kilómetros del aeropuerto para coger el Uber, a ver que virar al aeropuerto. Y cogimos una guagua ahí mismo, pero nos mandó para otro pueblo. Ahora nos bajamos aquí, tú estás en Candela, ¿viste? Ahora tenemos que coger un tren. Lo que me queda son... ¿Tienen batería? No, Emery tiene un poquitico nomás. Ok, bueno, suerte, déjame eh, saber. No, vaya, increíble esto, vaya, Emery está dando unos gritos y no quiere ni hablar. ¿Vas a hablar con tu mamá? No. Ah, ya tú sabes cómo está esto, ¿no? No, claro. Por lo menos hay un hotel. Dime, si, dime si por lo menos hay un hotel. ¿Cómo? Que si el hotel está resuelto, dime, porque si no, imagínate. Sí, ya, ya, ya me puse tu nombre. Esto está en Candela aquí, ¿viste? Esto no es Sarasota. Menos mal que yo no fui. Oh, gracias. Dale. Bye, love you. Wow, I thought that she was gonna, like, be mad. And she's like, oh, well, good luck. Good maybe, thing I maybe, didn't go. Maybe she 360 does. Oh yeah, oh, probably. We, she oh, does that for a 360. Man. Cause she, she would definitely have freaked out. She was like, oh, well, good Let's luck. Make a location off. No, she already saw it probably. You, you she definitely so. checked it when we weren't picking up the phone. Oh man. Bro, that's ruined now. Cause she definitely wouldn't have just been like, good luck. Tell me how it goes. Like what? <laughs> <laughs> like good thing I didn't go. How are you gonna say that to us if we're lost? <laughs> okay, well now I need Let to get my stuff. No. <laughs> Hello. Dale. Dime. Dime la verdad. Tell me the truth. You 360 us. 
No. ¿Qué pasó? Yes, you did. Te lo juro por mi hija que no. I can't believe this. Yo lo que te conozco y sé que me estás diciendo mentira. Estamos en Chattanooga, Tennessee. Can you believe that? ¿Qué? <laughs> Yo te digo a ti que esto, esto no más nos pasa a nosotros. Déjame ver la history, sí, sinceramente. <laughs> Emily se está riendo. No, está llorando, está llorando, me tiene loco. <laughs> Ay, qué mal sabe llorar. Me han metido en plan. <laughs> We're recording right now too. <laughs> oh wow! Pero qué pasó? La no, no, nothing. No, thank you. Thanks, thanks God, we went up to uh, budget. The other place that was next to Trifinity, Trifriti. I can't remember the name of it. The 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 one that you picked, and they say, "Oh, good luck. We out of cars." I say what? There was like 20 people waiting for two hours. I no answer yet. And if you move. And they call you, you're not there, you lost the car. Can you believe that? Not even to eat. Do you have a car or no? We went to Enterprise, my favorite uh, rental car place. They say, what do you want, baby? Anything you They're want. They're like, just pick any car. Anything you want. Say, give me this one. Get it. That's it, we're here. Park. But you are driving. No, we are already on the place. What place? My cheer comp, like where I'm practicing. No way. This, this is huge. No. <laughs> Huge. No, she we don't have want, time. We don't have time. We don't have time because we have to walk like 15 to get to the place. You gotta move. Yeah. Oh, but you're not here. Yeah. Bye, guys. We're a half hour of the place. Did you cancel the trip? No, because they said, What is the reason of the cancellation? I say, They canceled my flight because I didn't say there was a cola. Y they told me, no, you have to call the place because you know it was a speedia. You have to call the place and give the flight number and all of that. That's a lie, so I'm gonna lose the money. Jeez. How much you pay for this car? 71 a day. And we were paying for this 140, so that means like you pay like 120 daily, so. Nice. Nice. Okay, guys, I made it to the place. I had to borrow somebody's shirt because I kind of lost mine of this. And then I had somebody do my hair, and now we're just kind of waiting here until we're going to like practice and stuff backstage to prepare us for tomorrow and we'll see how that goes. Okay guys, I just finished my practice and we drove to the hotel and there's literally no parking because it's like on a corner. So we had to find this parking like garage and it's $60 per day, which is outrageous. And then it's another 25 just to park for the competition. And then it was another 70 just to get, in my, get my dad into the competition. This is crazy and there's so many people and I still haven't eaten so we're gonna try to find food at the hotel and we have to walk like down the streets with all of our suitcases and stuff okay guys we made it to the hotel and apparently the hotel did have parking which was $20 less but you know we all make mistakes and look at this nice like what's it called elevator like 10th floor yeah we're on the 10th floor there's 18 floors here. My friend, she's on like the 54th floor of her hotel. It's crazy. But they do have this one place that's open until 1 a.m. And that's more like kids friendly. So we're gonna go there. And then after we eat, we can go to the top to take the picture. Take a picture, yeah. Yeah, because there's a top thing where you can take, take a picture and apparently the view is really good. I'm so the we're gonna go there. Over there. Yeah, but it's way too cold oh, to swim. Okay, look at oh, this. Let's get the first look at it. I don't know what it looks like here. Okay, you got that. Can't see light. Oh, okay. A mirror, good. Oh, pretty big bathroom. Let's see. Oh, we each get our own bed. Let's go. Pretty nice room. Oh, let's look at the view. Let's look at the view. Not the best, but it's something. But now we're gonna go get food. I'm hungry. Okay guys, we're at the restaurant. I got a little Shirley Temple and I ordered a margarita pizza and then my dad got wings and this tuna poke bowl and we're gonna like split the wings. The Shirley Temple is not good. It kind of tastes like chemicals, so I'm not drinking it. Okay guys, here's my dad's tuna poke bowl. Yeah, try it, let's see your reaction. And I got a water because I didn't like my Shirley Temple. Good? So good. 
I got my pizza, but we're gonna be taking off the tomatoes and basil. Taste test time. It's good. But you know, nothing beats the margarita pizza we had in Italy. Oh yeah. That was the best pizza, but this is pretty good. We also got alitas, and then after we're gonna get some turtle cheesecake. So we got our alitas. That's what they look like. Let's taste test. Mm. And we got some blue cheese with it. That's money. They're spicy. I can feel my lips burning right now. Guys, here's our cheesecake. And then I need to go and shower because it's late. Okay guys, we're back in the room and now I'm going to unpack a little bit and shower and then go to bed because I'm so tired. We don't have to wake up that early tomorrow, so that's good. But I'll see you guys tomorrow for day one of cheer sport. Ew, there's like food in my nails. Okay. I'm gonna wash my hands, don't worry guys.